Hello, hello, and welcome to B6 Stop Motion. In this video, we are going to talk about frame rate and how to pick the right frame rate for different stop motion projects. Let's start by talking about frame rate in general. If you live in North America, most movies and TV shows are shot and displayed at 29.97 frames per second. In almost everywhere else in the world, including Europe, Movies and TV shows are displayed at 25 frames per second. In stop motion though, the most common frame rates are 24 frames per second, which is called shooting on ones, and 12 frames per second, which is called shooting on twos. Another very common frame rate these days in North America especially is 15 frames per second, which is half of their standard frame rate now let's try different frame rates on this project which you might have seen it in one of my previous videos the ease in and ease out tutorial i originally shot this video on ones so let's play it at its original frame rate now i'm going to change this to 12 frames per second as you can see, it is a lot slower and not as smooth at 12 frames per second. Here's another um, example, another stop motion project, which I originally shot this at 12 frames per second. Let's watch it on its original frame rate, 12 frames per second. And here is the same animation on 24 frames per second. 24 frames per second for this video is a bit too fast even though it is smoother it is going way too fast so if i wanted to deliver this animation at 24 frames per second i should have moved my objects a little bit less in each frame and have taken more pictures to make it look good at 24 frames per second so you might be still asking what frame rate should you choose the answer is it depends. 24 frames per second is great for fast movements, action scenes, and fight scenes. I also like to shoot very slow movements at 24 frames per second as well. 12 frames per second works for almost all other movements. Generally speaking, any frame rate between 12 and 24 frames per second is acceptable. Just be aware that 24 frames per second might be too fast for conveying emotions. So feel free to add pauses and holds to your stop motion for the audience to get a chance to connect to your characters. I personally use 12 frames per second for almost all of my animations. I think the animation should feel right no matter what frame rate you're using. That is all I have about frame rate for now. I hope I was able to help with understanding frame rate a little bit better and I hope you found this video helpful. If you found value in this tutorial, don't forget to hit the like button. For more stop motion and dragon frame related content, don't forget to subscribe. Also feel free to leave your questions or comments in the comment section below. I would love to hear from you guys. As always, thank you for watching and I hope I see you in the next one.